What are you doing? Walking. Do it somewhere else. No shit, Sherlock. Hey, you want to play soccer? Hmm. How come we never go to your place? Not some place you want to go. Why not? He's not nice. Jeremy! Tell Mom I'll be with Joe! She doesn't care, idiot. No shit, Sherlock. Want a cigarette? Joe, I told you. I don't see a snake. Oh, I'll show you a snake. Boy, you can kiss my ass. You leave him alone, Sarah. You man, you gotta pay for that. <coughs> I've missed you. You want some of me, Josh? Catch. Joe's shit. <laughs> You okay? Cool. How'd you find this place? It's where I hide from Jeremy. I can't believe you did that. Did you see his head? Yeah. Well, somebody's gotta look out for you. How did you know about them? Uh, this is a pretty good hiding place. My dad's shop opens in a week, and I guess I have to be there. I'm sorry. What's he gonna do? The store, what's he gonna sell? I don't know. Something. You'll write me, right? If I write you? Yo, promise? Okay, I promise. Who's gonna look after you? Who's gonna listen to you, Sarah McDonald?
Zach. Oh, I wanted his pancakes. Zach. Uh, well, this is Jerry at the bank. Terry's not returning my calls. And, well, there's a committee meeting on Tuesday, and I, well, you need to call me immediately. Hope your mom's doing well. Hey, Mom. Zach? Oh, so good to hear from you, honey. I miss you. Mom, what's this call from Jerry all about? I don't know. They won't give me my the prescriptions. The banker, Mom, I... not... Wait, what do you mean, your prescriptions? Well, they won't give them to me without... There's not enough money in my account. Well, I thought things were great at the shop. I thought business was good. I think they are. I mean, every time we drive by, they all look then so what's busy, the but... problem, Mom? I don't... I don't know, honey. I, I, I need my meds. I know you do. Look, just relax. I'll be there, okay? Thank you, honey. Jack here. Hey, Jack. Yeah. Listen, I can't make it in tonight, no. but I think Ricky's ready to run the kitchen no. on his own. So let's give him his break tonight, huh? No. You're the reason we got the Bluebells annual banquet. I've been after that for years. You are not letting me down. Yeah, I know. I'm the reason. Look, I'm telling you, Ricky is ready to do it. Let's just, let's give him his break. My mom, she's got some problem with her meds and she needs a prescription, so I've got to go, I've got to go take care of I this. I need you to show up when you're scheduled. Zach, damn it, he's a kid and not a chef. I'm counting on you. Just let him set everything up and I'll be there as soon as I can. Damn it, Zach. Okay? I'm sorry, Jack. Hi. Uh, you only have two packs of handkerchiefs left. Do you have any more in the back? No. It is $365. $365? Well, it's $1,095 without insurance. I'm pulling out the big guns on this one. I think that was $365. Hold on, just pretend. That was $365. Yeah. Yeah. 10, 20, 40, 60. Hey. Honey, thank the good Lord. I'm afraid I'm not feeling so well with how my medications. Here, Mom. Take it easy. Mom, I, I don't understand, though. I mean, I thought you said things were going great at the shop. They are. At least I think so. They have a really cute new girl mechanic. I'm not here to meet anyone, Mom. Okay? I've got to go back. 
And tonight. Oh. Sorry. I still, I still don't understand your boycotting your own father's funeral. Boycotting. Yeah, that's about right. He was your father. Mom, I gotta, <clears throat> I just gotta go check. That's what Terry's up to this time. No, 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 Terry's doing a fine job. Derek would have told me if the men weren't getting paid. So, it's probably just some foul up at the bank? Go talk to Jerry, she'll straighten it out. Okay. No, I'm sorry. There's not much in any of the shop accounts. The reserves are gone, Zach. They're tapped dry. There hasn't been a payment made on that business loan since your daddy passed. Well, what's in the house accounts? Well, this is odd. That doesn't make a lick of sense. Every time I drive by that place, it's busier than a beehive. You have until Monday to change their minds. I'll see if I can't get them to back off from foreclosure. But you're so much like your dad. We should miss him around here, you know. He was always there for anybody that needed anything. Okay. Yeah, so Wednesday? Wednesday. Thanks. Wednesday. Yeah. Friends are going. No. Please, Uncle no. Please. No. No. Please. No. No. It's history, like Kay-san. I mean, just give you anything about it. Uh, this ain't gonna go well. This whole mm -hmm. thing stinks, Captain. I know somebody has to report it. It just doesn't have to be me. Hey, Matt. Look, I gotta go. How about next time I call you? Hey there, beautiful. What do you want? Sorry, I don't have to call. I got you something. You need him anyway. Yeah, it was a her. And for once, you're right. No. Don't be that way, girlfriend. Selsley said that this bottle was the best thing in store. Then give it to her. Come on, sweetie. Now you want me. In your dreams, Terry. Hey, clean this place up. Hey. Hey, Terry. Is my hey. car ready? All right. All right, have Great a good one. Care. Thanks so much. Hey, so, uh, Harry, man, what's it been, man? Like 10 years? Yeah, at least that long. So how is the chef business? It's really cooking, Terry. You know, I just went by my mom's. She says that she hasn't uh, received a payment from you since you took over. <laughs> there's a recession going on, man. Has anybody told you? Yeah, I get it, but you know, there's, wow, there's lots of cars here, man. What are you saying? We're friends. Your meds, man. And I don't understand. Why, why are the payments so late? Dude, this is my place now. Really? Yeah. He owes me. Owes you? 
You were a kid, you needed a job, and my dad gave you one. It's time to find out what you've been up to. Oh, shit! Bitch! Hey, hey! I was gonna follow that. All three copies, even the customer's part? What else have you got in here, Terry? Hey, hey, man! I know we're friends, but... <laughs> Look at that. You see? You have some explaining to do. Here's a little down payment. <laughs> really? That's the best day in the store? Get out of here. <laughs> this is even more. I can't believe you did that. I enjoyed it more than you did. <laughs> I'm Mac. I'm Zach. Nice to meet you. And this is for betting against me. Are you me. kidding me? Oh, oh pretty. <laughs> you. Hey, Jack. How's Ricky doing? Yeah, see, I told you you could handle it. Look, there's a... I've got a few problems here. And, uh, I'm gonna need a couple of days before... No, Jack, you can't... Jack, listen, Jack! Yeah, Max can do that. Yeah, okay. Uncle R and D. Yes. How are you boys doing? You mind uh, you mind locking up when I go? Sure, boss. Okay. Will you be back tomorrow morning? Yeah, yeah, I guess so. It's good to have you back, man. Yeah, thanks. Yes, it is. Later, D. I should have taken that one, man.
Hey, Zach. There's just a guy here to pick up his car. Okay, uh, send him in. Okay. Hey, Mac. Thanks for saving my bacon yesterday. No problem. I've been known to like bacon. Hi, welcome to Frankincense. Yeah, where's Terry? He's not in today. Oh, um, I'll just go back tomorrow. No, it, hey, stay here, man. Uh, what's your name? Let's let's get you back in your car. It's uh, Grabinski. G R A B E Grabinski. Um, oh, you got a blue Focus. Those are great cars. Looks like we um. We fixed your timing belt, and uh, looks like the rest of the car's okay. Raphael did this one, he's great on Fords. Looks like his estimate was perfect too, it's 482, 50. Whoa, he said it was gonna be 300. Oh, is that your signature right here? Is that you? Yeah. Well then it's 482, 50, it's right there. Cash discount? Cash discount? Yeah, like, everyone knows y'all have, like... No, yeah. no, we don't. Look, it's 482.50. It's just like the estimate says, okay? You don't got that much. Okay, look. It's $30 a day storage. The first two days are free. You guys get your money, you call me, you come pick up your car, okay? Have a nice day. Get over. No cash sales, not one. You're talking to me, boss. You ever take any cash sales? No, no. I don't mess with the money. That was Terry. Hey, Jerry. Hey, Zach. Hey, Derek. Hey, Jerry. I don't have one cash sale recorded in here in five months. Sounds like you got a box in the hen house. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, well, I can't prove anything. You know, I'm sorry, Zach, but bank examiners, they really don't care. And your dad, he would be fit to be tied. Question is, can you do it? I don't know. I just... And I've got to have eight grand by the end of the month, or we'll have to foreclose. You have until Wednesday. Wednesday. This place is filthy, man. Yeah, yeah, I know. It got slow this afternoon, so we cleaned out the back. I will get this in the morning. I promise. In the morning? Yeah. Yeah, all right. All right. Get some rest. In the morning. I'll get in the morning, Zach. Just let it go, man.
Whose mama showed up? Hey. You want some coffee? Sure. You look like hell. Thanks. That's nice of you. Try that. It could look worse, believe me. Could be worse. So, you're Frank's kid? Uh, yeah. Is this your place now? For the moment. I'm really a chef. Oh. That's fine. Looks like you could eat in there. <laughs> Thanks. I can, I'm pretty good at cleaning. Oh, come on. This tastes so good. And coffee. <laughs> You know what? I just want to make this perfectly clear. However, I don't, I don't clean or do dishes or for sure don't wait tables. So if you're planning on turning this into some kind of fancy garage restaurant thing, I'm out of here. No, oh, you're a mechanic. I get it. But listen, I wasn't going for fancy. I was thinking along the lines of the greasy wench. You know, we get waitresses in short shorts. We sell deep fried everything and we let you fix cars around the back. What do you think? I don't know. We have one tap. Whatever you want. Maybe I'll come back for lunch then. All right. Mac, I'm not going to turn the place into a restaurant, okay? Good to know. It's not yet. Hey, next time you get your panties in wide, will you just like scrub a toilet, bake a cake, anything? This place was a mess. I mean, somebody had to clean it up. Well, you can sweep whatever you want, but just do not touch my tools. You had them laying everywhere. No, they were laying around exactly where I need them to be. Sure. And now I'm wasting all my time looking for them. Okay, I, I've got to clean, but I'll clean around them. Thanks, boss. Get out of my way. This is between me and Zach. They owe me. Look, 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 look. I know. Sorry, man. You have to clear out. They owe me. Look, I don't know what happened, and I don't want to know. But you gotta go. You steal from this place, you steal from us. What about me? I'm sorry. What is told from me? I'm sorry, Terry. But he's gone. What does he mean? Stole from him. In here? Looks like you took quite a bump out there. It's a bad wreck. Is anybody hurt? Oh, no. I did crack the glass in my cell phone. You texting? Maybe. <laughs> Well, your swing arms are probably okay, but your frame's bent. And uh, we'll put in a special kit so we can get that aligned for you. 
you'd be good to go. And you're gonna need a couple of new tires to match the old ones and an old rim. Unless you want to swing for a new one, but um, it's gonna be quite a bit. <gasps> oh man, this stupid tax is costing me a fortune. What's your cash discount? No cash discount. <laughs> I have to pay cash, and Crystal said that you have a 30% cash money discount. You're a pretty girl, okay? We do really good work here, and we stand by it. The shop's been here for 20 years. You ask anybody in town. And you can pay cash, but you're going to have to pay the full price, sweetie, okay? No pretty girl discount. No, no, no. <laughs> All right. Uh... Oh, man, I just... All right, your father was a good guy. All right, fix it. Fix it. When will it be done? Today's Thursday, so why don't you come back Tuesday? Okay. I will see you then. You want to take my car and call back and check on it? Okay. I'll call you. Mm -hmm. Call Bye. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye. Mr. G.A.R. Binsky, here for your car? Yeah, but I can't. Yeah. What? Why? I mean, I don't got that much. Okay, Mr. Grabinski, I'll tell you what I'll do. This isn't right for either of us, right? He didn't do anything wrong. The guy you made a deal with, he didn't have the right to make the deal that he did. Right. So I'll knock a hundred bucks off. Make it three eighty-two fifty. I don't want to take your car. I don't know what I'm saying, man. I'm not gonna take your car, so can you can you just meet me halfway on this thing? Yeah, bro. Just okay. uh just done. Yeah. How much was it? 382.50. Okay. Okay. So just one. Uh quick. Here, bro. trouble. And you can keep this too. Oh, I swear, where'd it go? Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Have a good day, man. <laughs> Mr. Grabinski. Huh? Shit. <laughs> I need these, man. Yeah, right. <laughs> Thanks. I'd say. Is this one right? Yeah. Oh, my God. Help me out yeah. here, give me the, um... Damn it. We should just stop messing with my stuff. Derek, can I borrow a torque wrench? Yeah, sure. Yeah, Mom, I'll clean my room. Yeah, it's right over there. Uh, uh, it's just an old beam wrench, though. Never could spring for one of those clicky ones. Yeah, me either. I used to have one at Emoto. Emoto? Italian Motorsports? Lambos and Maseratis. I worked in the training shop. Did Dick Parker's vet last year. Regional qualifier? Yes. Damn, girl, how come you're not still there? <laughs> Got complicated. I bet. Mac, no man is gonna look at you. And no, think about it. We can't help it. I don't care if you think about it. Just keep that to yourself. Just had it up to here. Bosses and captains that just think that they Captains? Can. You in the army? Yeah, it was a Marines, you ground pounding bullet sponge. <laughs> it was armored stuff with diesels, <laughs> gas turbines. <laughs> Jarhead. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that explains it. We used to tune bracers in the old days. And we were good, too. Everybody figured if we could do that, we could for sure fix their car. So, uh, where were you? Oh, why'd you stop? Somebody got to schmooze the drivers and get him in the door. 
Yeah. Wound you. Zach left. The old man, he just uh, he didn't have the heart for it anymore. What is this? I don't know. How'd the bus boy miss this? Mm -hmm. What's that? One of those trophies. Kill me like that. You okay. Why are you here so late? Renee herself. She deploys in two weeks. She'll be gone almost a year. She wants to go on vacation with her kids on Monday. That's just a rack and pinion change. What's the rush? Well, I rode with her the other day. Went good. I told her she wasn't driving 2,000 miles across the desert with her kids. We hadn't been changed. Yeah, driving all wobbly for 2,000 pounds ain't smart. Why didn't she change it sooner? She just inherited it. It was her dad's and she didn't really know the car. So? So it seems some people want to hang on to their dad when they're gone. Yeah, I've heard that. Yeah, I never really got it myself either. What happened over here? Here, in this room. I dragged a mattress to the dumpster. It was so nasty. Looked like it had been used, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, can you get me a 20 millimeter socket? I said a 20. Yeah, but you need a 22. What, will you just try it? <sighs> what do you know? How'd you know that? I'm a lot of the well, I didn't know you were a mechanic. Yeah, it was another one. With your dad? Another life. Have you had dinner yet? No. A burger for Bubba. With the sourdough bread? Sure. And a strawberry milkshake? You got it. Okay, but I'm buying. <laughs> okay, man.
Ah. What's in this? What is this? Obviously didn't put enough in. So, you're looking for new business, right? Yeah. Well, we have got to do something. I had three cancellations today. Well, a lot of racers were bringing their cars in here. You just tell them I was here. Or for the best. No. We are not working on race cars. Really? You can afford that? No. Who is that? This doing in here? What am I doing in here? This is my place. Yours? Hey, you left, man. You didn't want anything to do with, with the old man or this place. Why did you leave, huh? That's got nothing to do with you, man. I suppose this is yours now, too, huh? Yeah, you want some of me now, Terry? Still living with your mama? You gotta sneak in here to get you some, you little pussy. Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get off of me! I'm not leaving! You're dangerous. <laughs> I can't believe you did that. Somebody's gotta look out for you. What's happening here? I was just working late on Herzog's car. I saw uh -huh. a rat. And would this rat be, I don't know, about six foot tall, brown hair, ugly? How did you know? Yeah. Trying to break into the office. Yes, he was. The big red. Yeah, he sure wants in this office bad, bro. Mm-hmm. Hey, guys. Hey, boss. We're just checking the latest needlework. I don't know how pretty it is, but uh, <laughs> expressive. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what's he want, anyway? Who cares? Let's get to work. Mm -hmm. We got banks to pay, guys. Come on. Mm -hmm. Hey, Max. Yeah. If you really want to help drum up some business, there's a chamber meeting in town tonight. Will you go with me? What, for my people skills? <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, I just really think it's time we put a face behind our name, you know? You want me to wear a low-cut dress, some heels? You have heels? You're an asshole. <laughs> Look, I don't care what you're wearing. Just wear what you're wearing now. Just go. You want me to wear what I'm wearing right now? I don't know. Wash your hair or something. Ah, uh, yeah, you heard that part where I called you an asshole. <laughs> Shut up. You coming? Uh, maybe. Seven o'clock. Hey, hey. Is this what you had in mind? No. I mean, yeah. Uh, honestly, I had no idea. You look amazing. Thanks. You do, you look great. <laughs> really great. Uh, I got you this. What's that for? I thought you'd show up in coveralls and I just wanted you to look nice. I mean, you look nice. I mean, so, so people can see you like I see you, you know? You guys are all alike. To hell with your chamber meeting or whatever it is. Mac. Captain, I told you I don't want anything to do with that suit. Yeah, I know, it's just not me. Yeah, well, you can take your lousy suit and I'm sure you know what you can do with it, ma'am. Paul, look at that. This guy's gonna kick our ass. 
hitting that track at the same spot on that number spot. I don't know. I mean, right up until the straight. And then he just takes off. I don't know. I just why. can't stay with him. Man. I don't know. I don't try it every trick I know. I'm sick of this shit. And ever since Tej ponied up to get tuned at that that high dollar place, what's it called? Uh, Italian I, I, Italian Motorsports. Yeah. He's yeah. just kicking our ass. Baby, we, we are not losing that bad. I mean, do we really have to waste the money on that boutique? Yeah, we can always afford to send you your hey. boutique, though, huh? Hey. <laughs> uh, excuse me, are you talking about Tej Rajanapool? Yeah, you know him? Lime green bet? That's it. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, horses, the horses are not the only thing killing you. <laughs> okay. How do you know that? I did that car. Oh, yeah, honey, I don't think so. Hey, no, Johnson. bring it to Frank's. I'll pitch it back in the race. Frank's? What, Johnson place? <laughs> it don't work old racers. No. Hell, <laughs> he's dead. No, well, his son, Zach, knows it now. Zach. <laughs> Zach? What kind of name is Zach? I thought his name was Jack or something like that. No. Who are you? I work for Zach. I'm Matt. Hey, Matt. Matt. <laughs> Gerald Painter. Yeah, nice to meet you. And you are? Sharon. Hey, come with us. We need to talk to you. Yeah, no, I'd love that. And you've been to Frank's? $800 plus parts, another 800 if you win this weekend. Then you better win. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be waiting. <laughs> what are you doing? You got me. <laughs> you don't know me. Hey, Johnson. How things going at your shop? They're okay. I heard about old Terry and that uh, cash discount thing. That shit happened there, buddy. You know I got hey, Come on. She's good as she says she is. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Hi. What are you doing in my office? It's, it's, it's okay, boss. You know this kid? Yeah, she's family. What's she doing? Let's just give her a minute. Okay. Ew! Ew? They're my handkerchiefs. Really? <laughs> There's nothing down there. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. There's this. Where did you find that? We also had it in a hole under the floor. <laughs> what is it? I don't know. But whatever it is, Terry wanted it really bad. Mm -hmm. So this is what he was after. Go ahead, open it. Who's this little lady? <laughs> She's my niece, Anita. Hi, Anita. Thank you. Where did you learn to do this? You know, find people's stashes. My dad. He does it for a living. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, nah, man. <laughs> He's a locksmith. <laughs> but she's a genius. Last year, old man Simpson died, and he left his wife with nothing. She found 300 grand all the squirreled around the house. There was nothing. How's it going? I've counted it twice. It's still not enough. What, are you close? Uh, yeah, close, but we're going to need 1,500 by 5 o'clock. Well, maybe this will help. Gerald's car won last weekend, and it's sixteen hundred. Well, that. I mean, do you want it? Can you take it? I mean, you've never seen a cash sale. Is that? It's here. 
<laughs> Good job, Mac. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, honey. Hey, Mom. How things go at the bank? Whatever Mac did to Gerald's car, it worked. I just wish I could have done it some other way. Terry isn't... He's, he's not gonna get into any kind of trouble, is he? You know, honestly, I, I don't have the energy, Mom. Joe. Mom. All right, Zach, can we talk? What's up? That's what I wanna know. What do you mean? What happened between you and your dad? He used to love racing. Yeah, I did, you know? I loved testing. Uh, I loved tuning. I loved racing, Mom. Yeah. So... But I... What? I... I loved racing, Mom. Not, uh, I loved racing, Mom. You can't keep avoiding this, honey. Yeah, I know, Mom! Okay? Sherlock, don't buy me presents. I won't get you anything. It's not a present, anyway. It's a tool. And you need it. The shop needs it. You want me to take it back? No. But you get what I'm saying. Sure. Yeah, no presents. Yeah. What? You hear that? Yeah. That sounds almost like one of those fancy clicky torque wrenches. I always wanted me one of those. Screw you. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> You're going home? Yeah. I'm done. Hey, Mac, uh, you know that uh, Terry and Zach both used to race for the old man back in the day. Really? Yeah. Well, they had a fierce competition on track and off. Sometimes even coming to fisticuffs. <laughs> Some things never change, right? Hey, you're going to the VFW for a beer. You coming? Yeah, come on. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds good. All right. Let's oh, go. Let's go. I'm going to have to call you. I'll let you know if I can come, okay? Good. Okay. All right. Good night. Good night. Night, boss. Night. Yeah, hello. You can't put me in that position. She'll do fine without me. No, you just cannot expect for me to show up and shit. Yeah, everything okay? Ichi, boss. What are you doing? I'm walking. Well, can you do it somewhere else? No. I'm okay. I don't need a babysitter. Well, I know that. Then what are you doing here? I can't. I can't just leave you alone like this. You're... I'm fine. Yeah. Can't keep avoiding it. 
Yesterday just said the same shit to me. And I get it, I got pissed off and I just wanted to be alone, so. What? I'm just trying to figure out your game. I don't have a game. Yeah, everybody does. So I can be ahead, going into the number five. And by the time we line out of it, he's even. And what I just understand is he keeps pulling away. Yeah, I ain't never seen nothing like it, man. Gerald, he just guns it. He looks like a pig on ice. Tej, shoot. He looks like he's on rail. Tej, her name is Tej anyway. Tej Rajanapal, he's Indian. That ain't no Indian name. Shipping bull, now there's an engine name. I'm sorry to oh. interrupt you, but is it is that the only turn it happens? Yeah, only on that turn, on that turn. I looked at the numbers. He's heel and toeing like, like Michael Jackson's chimp on a school night. You ought to be able to keep up with it. And Mac, the regional finals are this weekend. We've got to figure this out. You guys talking about the fifth turn at Devil's Knife? Yeah. Just kick the camber in the rear outside and adjust your steering in. You'll make up for it. Hmm. It doesn't make any sense. Turn, it's almost always off camber. I mean, you, you're gonna roll no matter how stiff the bar is. You just, you hang in there and you use it. Crazy enough to be Einstein, you know? <laughs> you don't wanna try that on any other track. I mean, it, it gets a bit touchy even there. Huh. I don't envy you, man. I, I hated that place. Well, that boy's smarter than his daddy ever was. <laughs> That's some crazy shit there. What? Sound good? All right. <laughs> it worked like a charm sack. I mean, at first I didn't shim it out enough, and then I thought, what the hell? I put in everything I had. Oh no. No, no, we didn't do too much damage. Dialed it back. No, Gerald's is completely pumped. He wants us at the race. I can't. Why not? I mean, it'll be fun and good for business. I'm busy. I've got a, a, a meeting at 6. It's important. Well, what night is your meeting at 6? Tonight? Thank good, because the race is tomorrow. I'll pick you up at Black. If you're worried about my driving, you can drive. No. No, I... I don't want to drive. Well, good. Because nobody drives my car. God, I love the sound. What, what, what is going on? What is it? Are you okay? I can't. You, you can't what? I just can't. Okay, what do you, what do you mean you can't? Oh God, I can't. I think I'm having a heart attack. Okay, okay. Just breathe. Okay, I, I, I'm, oh. Um, this is not a heart attack. No. Just breathe. Zach, why didn't you just tell me you didn't want to come? Would you just call 911, please? Just get out your phone. Okay. Something's happening to me. All right, just do not throw up in my car. Okay. <sighs> Hold my hand. Okay, you're going to be fine. Oh, God, you're going to be sorry. fine. You're not going to throw up, are you? No. Hey, this 
this isn't the ER. The hell it's not. Try this, kid. If you can keep that down, I'll get you something strong. It's a deal. Thanks, Gloria. Zach, this is Gloria. She was an army nurse in Nott. She takes care of us now. Gloria, this is Zach, my boss. Nice to meet you, boss. Nice to meet you. You got something stronger? Oh, how about, let's just give it a minute. Okay. Hmm. You come here a lot? Sometimes. You know, when things get... Did you have it rough over there? It was okay. It's not as bad as some. Wow. Maybe I should get another one. I think we should get something to eat. They got food in this place? No, not really. How's the pizza tonight? Hey, it's your life. <laughs> So I paid my way through culinary school. I just, you know, I was the skinny guy. I, they had the buff guy, and I was the skinny, sexy, shaky guy. The skinny, sexy. <laughs> so what the hell happened to me back there? I mean, I felt like I was dying in your car. I don't know. I was just... Yeah, I mean, I just... I got all the clamped. That's how it starts. Your chest tightens up. You feel like you can't breathe. Yeah. Your heart starts to pound. Yeah. I mean, I've seen it worse. Hell, I've done it worse. You, you did it. <laughs> well, seen what worse? What was it? I just panic. You're telling me I had a panic attack. You, you, you should have seen your face. I mean, you were like, truly like as white as a ghost. I mean, why did I not have a camera? <laughs> oh. You think that's funny? I mean, no, I mean, I mean, seriously, I, I really Damn, do bro. know. I know how it feels. I do. Maybe it was panic. Gerald's going to be pissed. I'll get on. Is it... Is it something about dad? Is it racing? It's both. What? I'm sorry. Shut up. I don't, I just felt, I'm sorry. Get somewhere we can go. Is your mom still up? Always oh, wanted to sneak. Well, somebody's gotta be the grown up. <laughs> You're having way too much fun with this. Not yet.
Shocks yet for that right. truck? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Any of you guys seen Mac today? Uh, Mac? Mac? Uh, um, she was, uh, uh, no, uh, you know, maybe. She... Uh, hey, boss. Hey. Mm. I didn't know that you. Uh, nothing. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Hey, Mac. Uh, yeah. Um, I've got a, a water pump and a coolant reservoir for you. Okay, we'll just put it on my bench. Okay. Hey, Mac. share that information. And Zach, I don't normally share my bed either. So, I mean, I don't really know even how it happened. Just, I mean, it was all right. It's... Oh, no, just the one, one, one night. Yeah. Yeah, I totally agree. just all right. <laughs> so, I felt, I felt like, I don't know why. Zach, it was, it was better than all right. It was better than all right. Okay. 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 <laughs> There's a concert tomorrow night downtown. Do you want to go? Really? Really, as friends, we go as friends. Okay, it's friends. 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 Concert, huh? You know, those free concerts downtown are great. Mm. Frank and I used to go all the time. You miss me, Mac? Yeah. Nice Elaine, to meet you. an old friend. Zach, the lawn chairs are under the camping equipment in the back. Okay. Is this. Holy jeez. Did you drive this? Yeah, she's mine. Well, she is pretty. Okay, this is amazing. Yeah, she was a real daredevil in those days. And all of us used to love racing. Gosh, I miss those days. The noise, the excitement, the feeling like a family. You can't get her behind a wheel now to save her life. What happened? I'm, I didn't mean to pry. No, no, it, it's hard for me. I don't have anything to hide, at least I don't think so. Zach, Zach, you used to love racing. 
Is this Terry? Zach and his dad they used to stay up all night working on cars together. Some mornings I'd find them asleep at the shop or an old mattress. They were so then it all changed. Zach was so angry. And he wouldn't have anything to do with his dad. I never did find out what happened. And now Frank's gone and... I'm sorry, Zach doesn't talk about it. I just wanted to know. Yeah, me too. You ready to go? Yeah. I'll see you later, Mom. I don't know what time I'll be home, okay? Don't worry about her. We're having a girl's night out. Think you'll ever drive again? Those guys were amazing. And they're all right. There's that word again. Just all right. And then maybe it's just the company. Yeah, it could be. I'm thirsty. You want some? One man your way? Yeah. <sighs> you got any iced tea? Of course. <clears throat> wow. That's nice. I left a pitcher to sunbrew in Iraq once. Next day there was nothing but sand in a tea bag. Really? Yeah. God, that's hot. No. Just my jerk, CO. He was always nothing to me. How many cubes do you like? Just a couple. One, two. Thanks. Mm -hmm. uh, excuse me. Mm, sure. What are you doing? I'm just, uh, just cleaning up. My kitchen. I was just done. Yeah, well, maybe I like the way my kitchen looks. Yeah, well, maybe this is the wrong time to suggest a spice rack. <laughs> Sorry. Mm -hmm. I'll stop. I just... I'm gonna go take a shower, okay? Okay. God, you're beautiful. Go. Okay.
Get away from me! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, because I don't know if she's going to be a look. Yeah. <laughs> look what the cat drugged in. <laughs> well, <laughs> at least you look better than him. What? He's here? Uh, he was. He's gone. ceramic pads okay. and I'll start working on this. Alright. Just throw it back. Okay, yeah. Thanks. Receipt in there? 
I can't take that. Will you just, Mac, will you just look at me, please? Look, I went. Just look at me. It matches your eyes. I just want to see you in it. Okay. Just for me. This is what you want. No. Right here. Oh, God. It's right not about This is what this is all about. It's not about that, Mac. Then what is it about? Then what? I just wanted to take you to dinner tonight. I thought... I take it back. Don't be a jerk. Just take it back. I mean, what is it that you want, Zach? I mean, what do you want? I don't know what I don't know what happened to me, Mac. Sorry, Mac. I just want you to let me make it up to you. Okay. Take me dancing. I could. Yeah, to Victoria's. Okay. Though you probably will very neat. Secret. It's not fair. <laughs> you don't seem too slowed down, you know, by our our wreck last night. It's better living through chemistry. A couple pills, several of these. I'll be fine. I'm sorry. How about what? It's okay. It's really, it's okay. I hope you can work in the morning. I hear your boss is a real hard ass. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> hey, Earth is that? What's up? Nothing, I'm sorry. I just thought I would have my own restaurant by now, you know? Instead of working at that shit garage. Or anywhere but there. I'll be right back. Ready to go? Who's Kristen? Who? Kristen Webster. Yeah, she seems to be sending you all kinds of romantic 
Hexsmith. Well, okay, that one's just downright slutty. She's nobody, Mac. She's just a girl that I used to know. She won't leave me alone. Mm, that seems to be missing your body at night and your breakfast in the morning. I never stayed until breakfast. It's over. It's... Well, maybe I'll go through and I'm sure I'll find a Sharon Painter. Who else maybe would be in here? Zach? I mean, how many do you have, really? Let's just go ahead and get it out in the open. Maybe it's best I just know now. That's to me. Nah, it's not fair. It's not fair. I don't. And they should, you're digging through my wallet now. No, I, I just paid the bill. With my money? Zach. You pulled this out of my wallet? You're digging through my phone? What's wrong with you, Matt? I know who you are. How? Oh. I'm Sarah, Joe. Joe. I mean, or. I used to be Sarah. You never wrote me. No, you, you promised me. Oh. Go, 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 go in here. Go. Yeah. Mac. Jesus, Mac. <laughs> Here, keep it. Ew. Well, that is better. <laughs> no, I don't get it. Why does the payroll say your name is Michelle McDonald? Because my middle name is Sarah. <laughs> Michelle Sarah McDonald. Sarah. I see why you may have gone with Zach, since Zach is much sexier than Joe. Yes. 
later. How much later? Where have you been? I got a bucket. Oh. I mean, whose idea was this to sleep here? Yours, probably. No, we were. Maybe we should go someplace else, huh? Yeah, you wear your shirt back. No. What's Ew. wrong with it? Are you afraid of a little snow? Ew, don't touch me with it. It's gross. Such a boy. Are you coming? Zach, you're coming in. That's what your dad is, isn't it? Yeah. How's that? Oh, that's good. Thank you. For what? For not destroying that other shower curtain. What's that? It's a bag. I told you, I don't want any gifts. It's nothing. It's just it's something for work. That's it, okay? No big deal. I promise. You'll like it. Just open it. Funny. Stop. I'm just curious, that's all. Uh, me too. Okay. Now open it, girl. What now? We need you, Sarah. We have to have your testimony. So? Her case just isn't strong enough without you. Look, I already told you. It's, it's an occupational hazard. It's like IEDs. I know that's what they told you, Sarah. But they're wrong, and you can put a stop to it. I said no. We have to have your testimony. No. Absolutely not. No. 
You okay? Yeah, you're wearing it. I got the right size. That looks great. You know the good news? Things are backing up. We've got so many jobs. Don't leave it! Jesus, what's your problem? You. Me? Yeah, you. You're buying me this. And you... You messing with my work. Look, I was just... I was... What are you gonna do next, huh? You gonna order me to... Make another joke or something, Mac. I'm just kidding. Mac. Hey, what is up with you? Uh, uh, we're just we're just gonna have to cool it. Why? Um, because I can't handle this. Handle what? You and me, Joe. You're just yeah. saying that. I just need one minute. One minute. What the hell are you doing, Zach? I'm making you breakfast. That pan is clean. Enough. Zach, I told you not to yeah. come here. Yeah, you told me, but I don't agree. So here I am. I'm not going to eat. Don't suit yourself, it's going to get cold. They're not great cold. What? What do you think you're doing, really? I'm making you breakfast. <sighs> breakfast? What? Do you know how hard it is for me not to smash that plate over your head? Jesus, Sarah, it's just breakfast. No, it's not, Joey boy. It's you buying me shit and messing with my house and telling me what to do. I'm sorry, but Joey boy? Really? Quit struggling, struggling soldier. Sir, I said quit struggling. Jesus. Back, back. Back, I'm not going to hurt you. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. I'm not going to hurt you. I'm not going to hurt you. I'm sorry. Hey, look at me. It's Joe, it's Joe. It's me, look at me. Look at me. Oh my God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What happened to you? Did somebody do this to you in the army? There's the Marines. And you, you can go now. No. Sarah, you've got to face this. It says who, you? I mean, what if you face Zach? Huh? We're not talking about me. Yeah, well, I'll talk about whatever I want to talk about. Yeah, well, what am I supposed to do, Sarah? My dad's dead, okay? What am I supposed to do? I, there's Sarah, nobody here, there's no... She has nothing to do with it. Your mom was there the whole time. So? So you kept her completely in the dark? She didn't even know what he did. And you walk around like everything is perfectly fine. Just like me. So you really don't have any room to talk, Zach. Why don't you just come back when you have something else to tell me? Oh. <sighs>
Joe. You're here to take your mom to the store. Good. Listen, my schedule is terribly tight this morning. It's my grandbaby's no. birthday party. Party is this afternoon. I've got to get my nails done. The balloon's blown. Can you help? Please? Oh, yeah, Joe's going to take you to the store. Thank you, dear. I'm totally swamped. You okay? Yeah, Mom, can, can we, um... Uh, okay. Look, I need to... Mom, why did you stop racing? I don't understand what... Why? Mom! so afraid of driving. I mean, you used to be a race car driver, for God's sake. I mean, me, I know why I don't want to race, but, but you, what's your reason? Did, did you know? Did you? I drove into that shop after, after a particularly great practice lap. And they were on that It was me, Mom. It was me. What? No. No, honey, he loved you. He, he would never do such a No, he did. Deal. He did. I'm just like my mother. No. Mom, stop it. It wasn't you and it wasn't me, it was him. I used to drive around the curves of that racetrack and I used to hope, okay, I used to pray that I would just lose it. And you, but it wasn't us, Mom. It was him, it was that bastard, and I'm sick of it, Mom. I'm sick to death of this town just telling me what a great guy he was. He was? He was? You remember when I borrowed that go-kart and I crashed it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought he was going to bring your neck. <laughs> I'm scared to death, Mom. But he did it. He rebuilt it with you and built you a better one and taught you how to drive. It was awful, Mom. to spend the rest of your life dying. Maybe not. Come in. Are 
You did it. Oh, shit. Sure, Locke. I should have told her a long time ago. Mac, it wasn't just me. Usually isn't. It was Terry. It got him too. Oh. Well, that makes sense. That's how he took over the shop. You okay? I have to testify in two days. Is that him? Yes. I'll be there with you, Mac. Someone has to look out for you. Don't worry, I'm not going anywhere. I promise. I gotta pee. You better not be. Mm -mm. Because I want pancakes. A promise made as childhood friends. A solemn oath that never ends until the shadows flee. Shadows flee away. A picture torn, held close to heart, then fate stepped in, no longer apart until the shadows flee, the shadows flee away. A promise kept for years to come. You are my cherished home, my best friend, my love, my light. The winter. Promise made as childhood friends, a solemn oath that never ends until the shadows flee, the shadows flee away.